my channel. So for today's video, I'll be budgeting my first paycheck for the month of August. So without further ado, let's start with the video. But first, let's put in the date. So we're now on the 12th of August. And for my salary, I'll be budgeting total of 10700 And for my boyfriend, he gave me 2000 800 to budget for his cash envelopes so let's see how much that will be so that's 10,700 plus 2,800 so we'll be budgeting total of 13,500 so I put in all the categories ahead of time just before I start the video just to save time and we'll now move on to my fixed expenses First on our list is water, which I'll be putting total of 100 pesos. Electric will get 1,000 pesos. Internet will get 900. Insurance will get 1,500. Subscription will get 150. One month ahead will get 400. Fair will get 1,000 pesos. And pocket money will get 100. So let's see how much this will sum up to. So we have 100 plus 1,000 plus 900 plus 1,500 plus 150 plus 400 plus 1,000 plus 100. So we have a total of 5,150. So 13,500 less 5,150. So we still have a total of 8,350 to budget to our other categories. So next will be our variable expenses. So for rice, I'll be putting total of 500 pesos. Food will get 500. Gas will get 200 pesos. And for my boyfriend's personal expenses, he asked me to put 200 in here as well. So let's see how much this will sum up to. So we have 500 plus 500 plus 200 plus 200 so we have a total of 1,400 so we have 8,350 less 1,400 so we still have 6,950 to budget to our next category which is for my sinking funds so for my sinking funds, we have Christmas in here. So Christmas will get 200 pesos. New Year will get 200. Tuition fee, 300. This is for my boyfriend's brother. Tuition fee, since he's starting college soon. Fun will get 100. Health will get 100 as well. Home renovation will get 1,000. Home improvement will get 100 pesos. Grocery will get 200. Gifts will get 100 pesos. My boyfriend's gift sinking funds will get 300 pesos. Vacation will get 1,000. Beauty will get 100. Clothes will get 100. And miscellaneous will get nothing for now. So let's see how much this will sum up to. So we have 200 for Christmas. New Year will get 200, 300 for tuition fee, 100, 100, 1,000 for, oops, 1,000 for home renovation, 100, 200, 100, 300 plus 1,000 plus 100 plus 100. So we have a total of 3,800 for my sinking funds. So we have... 6,950 less 3,800. So we still have 3,150 to budget towards our next category, which is debt. But since I don't have any debt, so that will be skipped. So we'll now move on to my savings category. And first on our list is my personal savings, which I'll be putting total of 200 pesos. Pag-ibig MP2 will also get 200. Emergency fund will get 200. My Calamity Fund will get 200 as well. Retirement Fund will get 500. Investment will get 100 pesos. My Boyfriend's Business will get 500 pesos. My 52-Week Challenge will get 1,100. My 50 pesos Challenge will get 50 pesos. And 
Lastly, my 100 envelope challenge will get 100 pesos. So let's see how much this will sum up to. So here we have 200 plus 200 plus 200 plus 200 plus 500 plus 100 plus 500 plus 1100 plus 50, 50 plus 100. So we have total of 3000. 150 which will give us a break even result and that's it for today guys thank you so much for watching my video if you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel also hit the notification bell so you'll get notified whenever i release new youtube videos thanks for your time guys see you soon bye